Vice Chair Hubert Van Niekerk telling us all about this uh, disability insurance program that they're hopefully going to be bringing to Canada. So can you tell us, Hubert, uh, currently the current status, where it's at, where it's going, if you need any help, and then we can jump in a little bit. Yeah, so our biggest focus at the moment is actually for the for the government to put a, put aside some some uh, funding to do the research that's needed to show that it's that it's that the people want it and that it's viable and that it will be reliable. So it we, they won't allow us to copy and paste what they did in Australia. We have to do our own research. So we do have a letter into the finance committee of the current government to put aside money for this. So it's hard to tell what, how we we would be involved with that, or they might have a research organization or a minister may pick it up to say, this is how we're gonna do the research. But first off, we need the government to say, we need to set aside, you know, five, $10 million, whatever that might be to do the research, to get people on board and to start educating people. And have you had an op have you had any, uh, have you gotten in any doors yet? Uh, well, we've gotten in a lot of political doors uh, from uh, talking to politicians. Uh, I talked to one yesterday, talk, we'll talk to another one tomorrow. Um, several politicians who see this as, as absolutely needed. You know, there's, regardless of what program is out there, they're all discombobulated. They're a bloody nightmare to go through. And people are just, you know, fed up, even to the point where they won't even apply for help. In Australia, there's about 675,000 people on the program right now. Three hundred. How, how many? How many? About 675,000. Okay. There's about 375,000 that had actually never collected any money from the government before. Whether they thought they wouldn't qualify, they, they just didn't want to go through the hassle. They started and the process was so nightmarish that they said to heck with it and parents or, or family members have picked up you know, all the cost and have just basically given up on getting yeah. funding. And also there's, there's a huge indigenous population like there is here as well that have taken a, a bit longer uh, to, get, um, to get the services that they need. So they, they're also, you know, their system with indigenous is very similar to ours. So the hard to reach people, you know, the ones that don't get anything now that deserve it. This, this is amazing. Well, let me offer if the channel can uh, help you with getting any more doors. Because I know you probably tried a lot of doors. Unfortunately, you have to find the right door, right? But I mean, I'm not saying you guys won't because you probably will. But, you know, it's, a, it's it can be tedious. It's a long haul. So with our connections through the ministries and through the, the health sectors, um, if we can be of any help, if we can make any connections for you, uh, along with our media platform, because I think um, this is a great idea for Canada. We can put it on our Sirius XM show. Um, it would it would be great. So if the channel can help in any way, Hubert, uh, let us know. What I would like to do actually is because part of the reason we created the channel was to bring our community together across from across the land. So it seems like you obviously are working with every province and every territory. And if the channel can help by bringing everybody together through media, maybe through a Zoom. We can do a call together and, and spread the word. So if we can help in any way, um, we would love to. That's very good. I mean, we're looking for more representatives in different provinces. Uh, we have some good representation, not official, but in BC, um, New Brunswick as well. But keep in mind, everybody, everybody that, that's doing this stuff is a volunteer. I'm a volunteer. The board is all volunteer. Uh, advisory committee, the steering committee, we're all volunteer and we're made up of about half of persons with disability and half without disability. I think it's a good mix. We have a lot of associations that are giving us letters of support. If you look at our website, we have quite a few official sort of sponsors at our, on our main page and we're getting more uh, all the time uh, with, uh, with organizations. Do you have a next step? Yeah, well, the next step really is to get that financing. Okay. And, uh, and also on our website, and I do want people to look at our website, but we do have a sign-up sheet there as far as a petition type of thing to show your support. Okay. So under... Uh, That's a good uh, one. That's a good yeah. one. Maybe we can so, share that maybe for you. Yeah. Under, under support on our website, everycanadiancounts.com, 
um, go under uh, under support. Uh, it's either under initiatives or under support. But it's good to look at our website anyway. What's there? Give it out the, again. Give it out again. Everycanadiancounts.com. So if people wanted to get involved, they could just go to your website and browse and see how they can sign up and help the cause, right? That's correct. And our email is there. It's simple. It's info at everycanadiancounts.com. Well, this is great, Hubert. If you could, I would recommend maybe all of your team join the Disability Channel platform, social media platforms, as we will be blasting out this interview. And more support, the better, you know, numbers, numbers, numbers. So it would be great. And I, I really appreciate you coming on the show today. Uh, open dial, you can come on anytime. I'd love to hear updates. And like I said, the channel would love to get involved and support in any way we can. That's amazing. Thank you, Jay. Thank you, Hubert. Really appreciate what we're going to do. We're going to come back and we're going to wrap the show. I want to, again, I want to thank from every Canadian Counts Vice Chair Hubert Van Niekirk. Hubert, thanks again. You're doing a great job. You're doing a great thing for people and it's dearly needed. So I really appreciate it. Thank you. We'll be right back to close, close the show. <laughs>